Hello, my name is Dr. Shahid Bari. I'm the medical director of University Hospital of Morecambe NHS Foundation Trust. Today is the 4th of March 2021, and this is the COVID update. As you may know, that across UK, we have got more than 12,800 people who are suffering from COVID in hospital beds. More than 1,700 of them are being ventilated at present. Across the trust, we have got around 100 patients on our hospital beds. This obviously excludes the people who have been COVID positive for more than 14 days. So far, unfortunately, we have lost 590 people in our hospital beds from COVID and my sincere condolences to their family. And we offer support to them in the difficult time. Our bed occupancy remains high, which is more than 90 percent. However, we are still open for our usual business. We have got beds in ITU, we are open for urgent care, we are open for emergency care, and our cancer care is continuing. Our ED is continuing to look after patients as and when they arrive according to their need. As you would know, the healthcare pressure remains high, though its numbers are going down, which is a very welcome news and very good news. If you need any healthcare support, please do not hesitate to get in touch with NHS through 111 to ring your GP as appropriate, or if it is an emergency, please do not hesitate to ring up 999. We are trying to make sure that we do release the ambulances as quickly as we can, as because they have got a high pressure of moving patients around the patch. More importantly, it's good to know that a number of vaccination is going really good. We have got millions of people across UK who have been vaccinated and people are continuing to maintain the social distancing using face mask and using hand gel, which is having an impact on the number of infection going down slowly, though in some pockets of UK it has gone up. So my sincere advice and plea, please do maintain social distancing use your face mask, use your hand gel as appropriate, and I'm sure we will go through this pandemic and the crisis will be over at some point. Thank you very much for all your help and my sincere thanks to all the NHS staff for tireless hard work and all the people in our community who has offered significant support and my gratitude to all of you. Thank you.